we're going to go ahead and do the pre-evaluation um, evaluation. Go to push you this way, you resist and hold on. Good. And then here. Okay, that's not good. So what's happening here, there's some inhibitions going on in the muscles because something in the spine is misaligned. Once you get that misalignment corrected, these muscles will begin to fire again. Arms in front of you. Yeah, so again, and resist. Oh, that's not good either. Oh, and hold. Okay. Let's drop to the chest. So when the rib cage gets out of alignment, it's hard to breathe. You're not going to have proper oxygen carrying capacity to your brain. Your performance decreases, so that gets fixed. Now breathe in and breathe out. Pubic bones out, so that gets misaligned as well. Affects your balance. Squeeze together and push outward. And feet straight out. Hold the arm up. Resist. Good. Better. Better there. Relax. Push out to the side. Resist. Much better. Okay, that needs to be later. So this is a cold laser, so we have to turn this on. Hold again, and got it, Feet, um, fingers apart, push out, push out, and that's fine. Go back to the spine, hold strong, hold strong, hold strong. T3 is misaligned, it goes to the lungs, you need that to get your oxygen. T5 is to the stomach, T9 is to the adrenals, T12 controls your immune system. Now we check the pelvis for balance. These usually, there's a good indicator here if you could see that this goes further down than that, and that usually indicates there's a sacral misalignment. And we realign it by dropping it. Breathe in, breathe out. And bend both again. And like magic, the body balances itself. Bend this here. Cool. Check the SI joint, and that's off too. Again, bend this again. Hold. That's not happening. Keep it open and stretch it. Bend this again. Hold. Good. Good. So, not that you ignore an area of complaint, but you always want to balance a CNS first because that's where the software is, that's the hard drive. So once you balance that, then you can look at extremities, because many times those extremity issues will correct themselves if you fix the middle part first. So what we do is we challenge that, hold strong. Hold it. I'm going to drop it down a couple of times. and the ankles misalign. So now watch this, this is really important when it comes to injuries. A lot of people will focus on where they feel the problem, but not analyze, and they'll try to strengthen the muscles, they'll you know, do some um, soft tissue work, or realign it. But what's happening here is you have to analyze the whole kinetic chain in order for you to evaluate where these misalignments are. It's much easier to balance the body the way it's supposed to be balanced, and the, on the only thing that's gonna tell you is the body. You can't determine it on your own. So this ankle needs to be realigned and good. Here's another point that's important. Here's the symptom, right? Do we stop there? What about checking the other side? Just because something's not symptomatic doesn't mean it's balanced. You know, this is a really important principle. 
good. 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 That's fine. All right. So, looks like we're good for now. Now, stand up. So here's another thing. We checked him lying down, right? That's now weight bearing. So now you want to check the body after you've made the corrections when it's gravitationally loaded. We'll test this again. Remember these weaknesses? Hold. And that's really strong. Hold. Really strong now. Arms in front. Hands together. Good. Beautiful. Perfect. I'm jealous. <laughs> Can you do that now? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't resist it. <laughs> so, um, any feedback? Uh, hopefully, uh, you know, I'll be all good for my competition tomorrow. But I was way out of whack, so that's yeah. why I wanted to come up here today. Right. I know how important it is. And you know, that's really important. Just a lot of times, the way we work in society is that we're very reactive because that's just the way we are. I mean, we don't, you know, what's, what's the old saying? Like, if it ain't broke, don't fix it kind of mentality. Well, you know what? That works in emergency situations, but if you really want to be ahead of the game, proactivity is always easy. Um, it's much more return on your investment. You know, easy life now, hard life later. Hard life now, easy life later. Those are the principles that we have to espouse. So, um, Dr. Dennis Mariano, this is our Sports Chiropractic Minute. We do this every Friday, so we're going to tune BART up every, every time. And thank you for being here with us. And if you have any questions, you can go to our website, drmariano.com, and we're always here on Facebook. And it's great to be with you. And thank you again, BART, and thanks, Ashley, behind the camera there. Thanks, Ash. Yeah, okay. my care. pleasure. Have a good day.